So this video, we are going to see the base method of multiplication with the base number 100. So let me write that first here, base 100, base 100. So when we talk about base 100, we normally take numbers near to 100. It can be less than 100, it can be more than 100. Okay, so I have written a group of numbers here. So by seeing the number, you can see a pattern in it. In the first two, in the first two, I have taken both the numbers less than 100. In the, this group of numbers, I have taken both the numbers more than 100. And here I have taken one number less than 100 and one number more than 100. So here we have a combination. The first group we have both the numbers less than 100. In the second group we have both the numbers more than 100. And in the third group we have one number less than 100 and one number more than 100. So how to multiply these two numbers? How to multiply these two numbers? And how to multiply these two numbers? The method is different. Okay, let us do it one by one. Here we have seen the base number is 100. The given numbers are less than 100. So now let us see what is the deviation of the given numbers from base number. What is the deviation of given numbers from base number 100? Okay. So here we have base number 100, here we have 96. So 96 is deviated from 100 by minus 4. Similarly, 97 is deviated from 100 by minus 3. What I want to do is, what I want you to do is 96 minus 100. What is the answer? Minus 4. 97 minus 100. What is the answer? Minus 3. So when we talk about the deviation, the given number minus base number so we get minus 4 here 97 minus 100 minus 3 here so first step is we need to write what is the deviation so we have written the deviation minus 4 and minus 3 now the second step is we need to multiply these two numbers so minus into minus always we will get a plus answer minus into minus we will get a plus answer 4 into 3 12 we have seen in the previous video multiplication by base 10. When we did multiplication by base 10, in the right hand side we have written only one digit. But when we have base 100, we have to write two digits in the first place. The first part of the answer, we need to write two digits. Very, very important. When you practice with more and more numbers, this order will become very easy. Here we have two zeros on base number. So right hand side, the first part of the answer, we have to write two digits. When we have base number 10, we will write only one digit in the first part. When we have base number 1000, we will write three digits. Accordingly, it goes. So 4 into 3, 12. So I have written that 12 here. Minus into minus, I will get a plus answer. So plus 12. Now what is the second step? Here it is minus 4, here it is 97. We need to do a cross subtraction. A cross subtraction. 97 minus 4. What is 97 minus 4? 93. The same answer you will get if you subtract like this also. 96 minus 3. Any one of the cross subtraction you can do. 97 minus 4 or you can do 96 minus 3. Both will give you the same answer. So 96 minus 3 is also 93 or 97 minus 4 will also give you 93. So that 93 you can put here. So you got 9312, 9312. That is the answer when you multiply 96 and 97. It is very, very easy and I'm sure if you practice it, you can do it within seconds less than five seconds you can complete it for example let us take a number like this 98 multiplied by 97 and you need not to think it now you got the concept you can easily do it how 98 is deviated from 100 by minus 2 97 is deviated from 100 by minus 3 3 2s are 6 i told you always whenever we put the answer in the first part we have to put it in as a two digit number so 2 3 or 6 means we have to put it as 0 6 and then cross subtraction 97 minus 2 95 so we got the answer 9506 when you multiply 98 by 97 
always remember the first part of the answer will be a two digit number second part is obtained by cross subtraction in this case it is cross subtraction in some cases it will be cross addition okay so here both the numbers are minus so we will do cross subtraction it depends upon what sign is here here it is minus so 97 minus 4 it is cross subtraction similarly let us go to the next number here you can see both the numbers are more than the base number more, more than 100 so we will write 103 minus 100 will give you plus 3 here and here you get plus 4 here you got minus 4 and minus 3 because both the numbers we have taken less than the base number 100 here both the numbers we have taken more than the base number so here it is plus 3 and here it is plus 4 so now when you multiply these two 3 4 are 12 you got the correct answer on the right hand right hand side that is plus and plus will give you a plus answer only here instead of cross subtraction we will do cross addition 104 plus 3 104 plus 3 so 107 the same answer will be obtained when you do this way also 103 plus 4 107 so either you either you do cross addition this way or you do cross addition this way the answer will be same so right hand side two digit the remaining parts in the left hand side so 10712 is the answer when you multiply 103 by 104 this method of multiplication is called base method of multiplication with the base number 100 so in the first two cases we have seen numbers less than 100 numbers more than 100 and in one case i have taken cross subtraction in one case i have taken cross addition but in the both the cases right hand side if you see minus into minus will give you a plus answer plus into plus also will give you a plus answer but this situation will be different when you go to this number here we have one number is less than 100 and one number is more than 100 whenever we have one number less than 100 and one number more than 100 here the deviations will be in minus as well as in plus so when you multiply the right hand side you will get a negative answer so we have to make some arrangement there then only we can find out the answer final answer so let us solve this question also so here the deviation will be how much the deviation will be minus 2 and here the deviation will be plus 4 minus 2 into plus 4 minus 2 and plus 4 minus and plus negative and positive when you multiply you will get minus 8 is the answer two fours are eight so it will be in minus eight minus eight then here you can do a cross subtraction one zero four minus two one zero two or you can do a cross addition here 98 plus four the same answer you will get one zero two 98 plus four cross addition or cross subtraction one zero four minus two one zero two 98 plus four one zero two in both the cases you will get the same answer but we cannot make the answer like this here we have a minus so we, we need to remove this minus how to remove that minus that step is a extra step for numbers like this whenever we have numbers one number more than 100 and one number less than 100 this step will come a minus number will come on the right hand side and we need to remove that minus number how to remove it is very easy from here take one this side so this will become 101 102 i am taking one this side so balance will be 101 that one which i have taken here that will be equal to the base number that will come here as a base number minus 8 so this part will become 92 this will be 101 10192 is the answer 10192 is the answer let me explain it once again what we need to do is up to here you understood 102 minus 08 we cannot put minus here we need to remove that minus that means we will borrow one from here to this side we will borrow one from here to this side when i when i borrow one from here to this side this side will become 101 102 minus 1 101 that one we have taken from here to this side that one will be equal to base number that is 100 100 minus this 8 100 minus 8 will be 92 that 92 answer you have to put here and 10192 is your final answer when you multiply 98 by 104 so we have seen three different steps 
in the first step we have seen when both the numbers are less than 100 we have seen when both the numbers are more than 100 and we have seen a special case also in which we have one number less than 100 and one number more than 100 so take more and more numbers and practice okay we'll meet again with a new trick in the next video take care bye bye